see some of the names that will be joining us, quite a list. One of whom, of course, Max Wainwright, is this man, El Laguero. Slight departure from the World Cup here as we go to a What Culture Pro Wrestling faithful and a favorite talking about El Liguero. Are, are you a fan? I've been a fan of El Liguero for a long time. I've been in the ring with that man before. Oh, Don't yeah? remember much about it because he hit me pretty hard. Look at you putting yourself over. That's my job. <laughs> El Liguero brings a high flying, very fun atmosphere to the ring and his opponent tonight is a, uh, a rather unique character but I'll, I'll wait for him to be introduced on his own right now let's feast our eyes on El Ligero El Ligero has drawn Drago in the first round of the Mexican qualifiers that'll take place April 30th but like I said, miles to go before we sleep. Tonight, Liguero has a, uh, like I said, an interesting assignment ahead of him. in because of course Grado everywhere he goes in Scotland he is actually a household name now he is the Hulk Hogan of Scotland <laughs> really now yeah. I'll be on the lookout for his videos I don't know if we were allowed to make any references to A little variation on the name. The fans are leaving the R out of Grado, and uh, I'll let you figure out the rest. Well, there's certainly no videos of that, I can promise you. Both men squaring off. <laughs> now, 
I'm a big fan of the old world of sport. I, I remember a wrestler by the name of Big Daddy. I think Grado may be uh, somehow related. Well, he is wearing the Union Jack tonight. There you go. <laughs> All right, Mr. David, I'm going to let you drive on this one. Thank you very much. But you know what? I have to tell you tonight, don't make any mistakes. It looks like Grado's just messing around, but he does have the utmost respect for all his opponents. But he's not just wrestling for himself. He's not just like someone from the prestige who's going to look after himself or look for strength in numbers. Grado is going to wrestle for himself and for everyone else in the building. Hey! 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 But El Ligero hey! oh. doesn't quite know what to make for it. Of course, he's gearing up for a big tournament himself. Probably looking for some actual competition. Of course, you think of great uh, charismatic wrestlers throughout history, and uh, I wonder where Grado ranks in there. <laughs> well, Grado, of course, he has started to make a name for himself overseas, wrestling in the United States with Impact Wrestling. Yes, I've uh, come to somewhat hate his stuff with uh, my old friend Robbie E., but uh, let's talk more about what's going on here right now. Of course, well, Grado dominant. Perhaps El Aguero wasn't sure what to make of Grado to start this match. Either that or he's just being incredibly polite, but he pushes Grado off into the ropes. <laughs> and this is the athleticism that Grado is known for, of course. It doesn't get any better than that, I'm, I'm serious. Between that and your commentary, this is an instant classic. <laughs> Oops. Cover two. Not enough. Oh, it will never be enough. Grado disagreeing with Sean McLaughlin as well. well. That's not hard to do. But of course, he, he's going to enjoy the time that he's got out here. He is an actual performer. You know what? This building is actually normally used for hosting pantomime acts. Grado, no disrespect to him, he is a legitimate pantomime act. Uh, can you pantomime your commentary? <laughs> Me either. Hey, there's nothing wrong with guys. Like <laughs> hey, here we go. I love the crowd. Grado looking for support here. The crowds in Scotland and Britain Island, the entire United Kingdom, just, just great, great fans. Headlock by El Ligero. Not for long. Down goes Grado. Now the ropes gave Ligero quite the momentum there. Quite the departure from the uh, the World Cup matches, the competition that we've seen. But uh, listen, pro wrestling is supposed to be fun. There's it's nothing a, wrong with that. It's a variety act. It's a buffet. Mmm, food. Oh, Grado. Grado went for a shoulder tackle. No dice in the second attempt either. <laughs> Seriously, is it going to take... When is El Ligero getting the strength? <laughs> Grado is uh, five. not the most conditioned of all athletes here, and he's kind of worn himself out here. At this point, you might just want to use his entire body weight, but... <laughs> oh. You want to translate that? It's no? universal. Right it's on. universal, Matt Stryker. Trying to uh, <clears throat> disorient. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what? Don't do it. Don't, don't, don't end the gurry, Sean McLaughlin. No, that's not. Good that's enough. a disqualification. Well, he hasn't done it. There is. Uh, there is. There, there is. Sorry, uh, we tried to keep uh, it at bay, but there's a dark side to Grado. Right. No. And now some wrestling. Oh, hopefully. Well, and now you swept into the corner. El Aguero springboarding from the ropes. Um, oh! Go on ahead there, Grado. That could, that could be a video. Go get yourself some. 
once saw the fabulous Moolah do that. Just gonna leave it alone. How long have you been around? <laughs> I watch TV. Head to the corner once again. Oh! Drado with his peak athleticism again. Oh, oh, no! Oh. <laughs> Not tonight. Yeah, yeah, try it again. Try it again. Well, you know what? This match has been incredibly sportsmanlike. Sure. It would only be fair to let Griddle have another oh, attempt yeah. or five. <laughs> we referenced the Dynamite Kid earlier on. Of course, the great Tiger Mask would pull off moves like this, but Grado is no Tiger oh! Mask. Oops. Well, Shawnee got it in the eye, didn't he? I foresaw that coming. Sean didn't. El Liguero may have to use the element of surprise here. Schoolboy roll up. <laughs> but only a two count. Grado not going to fall for that. Drop to hold. Back in the day, this is what they'd call the popcorn match. Because after intermission, all the fans would have their popcorn and they would sit and watch a, an entertaining matchup. And now the chance of 619. That, of course, the move for Rey Mysterio, who we will see. And now he just He's calling the it the old, the old one four one That's the Glasgow the area code. All right, then there you go. Although technically this is Motherwell, this is 01698. All right then. <laughs> but we're gonna transfer it. 0141 coming in. Oh no. What the oh. heck is going on here? Oh. Oh. You know, the last time I saw Lee Gary, he had a Ring of Honor title match against Christopher Daniels, and now... What a departure! What an incredible departure it is! Yeah, such is wrestling. <laughs> All right. Okay, going for the fanny pack. A bum bag. A bum bag is what we know it's over here, but... You know. Grado is Americanized, he's got that... Got the stars and stripes in his gear as well. Now, I know what, what some wrestlers I know keep in their fanny packs. And oh, oh God. God. Do they keep that? Uh, some do. I guess Grado is now Mexican. Is that a... What's an El Generico mask? What is that? It probably is El Generico's mask. <laughs> it may give him the power to hit the 619. Or just a, an American arm drag instead. One more. <laughs> oh, look at that. The Alita. The around the world. He's picking up the pace here. Look at that. Lucha Grado. TM. <laughs> oh, folks, oh, God, uh, it continues. He's... <laughs> Go on, that's all Gr you. Grado Mania running wild here in Motherwell. As he hits the top rope. He can't face it. I, and you know what? I don't even think he can see in that mask. <laughs> Listen to the fans. <laughs> second rope. Settle for the, the, the second's fine. Just go for it. Uh, you know what? Oh, God. It, I feel like Bruce Forsyth. High or lower, Grado? What's it going to be? Oh, my God. <laughs> Boy, oh boy, the hang time on Grado is Unbelievable. Just, uh, oh my quite unimpressive. And now. Oh. No, he's oh. going to unmask him. It's That's Grado. The, the biggest oh my God. you can do in Lucha Libre is to take someone's mask. I went into my Gorilla Monsoon right there. See, the crowd knows it. That is incredibly disrespectful, as El Aguero should have known. Not only that, but his mask has an advantage. He's got horns on his! Well, let's, uh, let's hope that Ligero isn't unmasked. Have you ever seen him without his mask? I never have. But I heard he's uh, quite the handsome fellow. Not after these punches. <laughs> Especially this elbow! Oh, get funky like a monkey, baby. Yes. It's like watching a wrestling mixtape. Stinger splash. <laughs> and now... Perhaps a Bronco Buster? It very well could be, but you know what? If we're oh, gonna no, go back to no. the, if we're gonna go back to the great old oh. it's the roll and slice. Jeez. Which translates to a no, sausage no. roll in England. Yeah, he's gotta cover him the other way there, great old. Come on. Two no. Young Benny Hill could not get the Duke. Well, you know what? What? Benny Hill. I would say actually had a bit more of a physical advantage. Think of all the women that were chasing <laughs> Benny Hill all those years. Yeah. How fast did that man have to run? 
Well, Grado has gone under the ring, and it always surprises me the things you'll find underneath a professional wrestling ring. And he's oh got my a, oh oh. oh. <laughs> is it Damien? Is it is it Swaggle in the bag? What is it? I don't know if you'd be able to get Damien through customs. What's he got here? What's he got here? What's he got? Come on. Oh, no. oh, oh my uh, god! Chips! Look at that, a sponsorship. Well, All the chips are hungry. available. Mm. Could this be it? Uh, could nah, this, could nah, this nah, be Grado the he's Animal? He's not going to do it. By a god, the man has a family. Oh, no. Come on. Uh, that nacho cheese is giving Grado the energy he uh, needs, but... Don't, don't do it. it. Don't, don't do, do it. it. No. Those sharks could tear through Alligator's skin like glass. It's no. Nacho cheese. Uh, oh, wait a minute. No, uh, Grado uh, covers it. I thought the chance of EC Dub were about to break out. Alligero with the back elbow ascends to the top turn buckle, a middle at least. Oh, oh gosh, closed right hand there by Grado. Maybe he's giving Grado the advantage by just staying on the middle. And now the Zoftig one, <laughs> Grado, hooks up Ligero. Here we go. Could this be a superplex? Onto the, onto the nachos. No, oh, this is. Come on. For an exhibition match, this is incredibly uncalled for. I've never seen. Uh, I knew there was a dark side to Grado, but I never knew it could be this bad. Yeah, well, we're, we're kind of seeing half of his dark side right there. <laughs> oh, whoa! Oh, oh. oh. Elegero oh. narrowly avoiding those Doritos. He needs the salsa, baby. Oh, oh Grado! Oh, wow! Onto the chips! He got him. <laughs> Elegero shredded by those Doritos. It kept him down for a three count. We need a manic! <laughs> analysis here. Talk us through that ending. That was, of course, Grado's trademark. I've never seen it in any other wrestling promotion by anyone else. Never. Never. The Earth Grado. Never. Out of nowhere. Onto the deadliest of all foreign objects, of course, the Rios. Have you read the back of those packets? Wow, yeah. Do you know what's in those I things? I kill you. There might be something else in there. Why not go for a look? Might be another mask. A brick. Or <laughs> ah, the sportsmanship of Ellie Gary. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, that's funny. A good time had by all here. Hello, I'm King Ross. I've been asked to shield some merch, but since I don't get a cut of my own merch, I'm having nothing to do with it. So here's Hobo Joe to do it for me. Shill that merch. Take this microphone. Uh, hi. Uh, I'm Hobo Joe. And uh, uh, I've got some t-shirts. So we've got a, a Bullet, Bullet Club one. It's Bullet Club. And... Uh, the, the Young Butts, nice and colourful there. Uh, you can uh, get these signed at WCPW shows by all of your favourite uh, wrestlers. Uh, and me, but you probably don't want that. Um, that one now, oh, this one. Uh, that's the Prestige. Uh, the World Cup, for our, our lovely World Cup. Uh, what else? We've got uh, Cody, Cody, Cody Rhodes. Cody Rhodes. And the last one. Uh, <laughs> the <Yeah. laughs> Come on, okay, I'll help you.